um, in the end that the winery has to be functional and not just there for display. Okay, so this is the white wine production area. Red wines, the more gentle you treat them, the more gentle they show up in the bottle. So these tanks are all set up with the climate control jackets as well to regulate the fermentation and they're all set up for a forklift. And so I can basically pick this tank up with a forklift, dump it, gravity flow into my press, which is a lot more gentle than forcing it through a pump. And uh, the same thing with the wine. Once it's out of the press, you can take one of these tanks, drive it into the barrel room, raise it up and siphon it into the barrels. So it's, the, the approach is very gentle. That's how I can make red wines at 90% gravity flow. And just open it. And then the crush of the stem is a, is a very basic uh, crush of the stem. The purpose is basically to separate the fruit from the stem. So you can see the beater shaft in the middle that just beats the fruit off the stems and then uh, the fruit will fall through the holes that's in this drum. The stems fall out in the front into a bin which goes to a compost pile. Uh, and then the berries will fall through the holes into that pump and then from there it gets transferred to the press. So the, the press we have is a membrane press. So it has a bag inside that uh, works with the air and as it increases pressure it squeezes out the juice. It holds four tons, very gentle, everything is pre-programmed. Um, so I can do anything from champagnes to uh, varietals that's more difficult to press because of the thickness of the skin, things like that. So very, very easy setup. Uh, the design and layout of the winery is so that even though we do 5,000 cases, we can successfully, without any hassle, uh, run this with two people. This was put together uh, last August. Um, these are also 100% French. And we're the only um, winer in the state that has these specific casts. Um, the reason is uh, they're not just for aging, but also for fermentation. So they have a 67 inch hatch on top that you can put the reds in. Uh, they'll spend the duration of fermentation in the casks. And then uh, we can take out the, the, the skins after fermentation, press it, put it back for aging. Um, these were custom made for us, um, like I said, in France. and. Uh, about 950 gallons each.